Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back uh, to another video. This is a brand new series I'm starting called Blind Guy Plays. I'm Mr. Blind, and uh, it's time to get my blinding gaming on. That made no sense. But today, we are playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. This is my epic gamer look, my epic blind gamer. Um, you want to be as epic as me? The, there's only one way to become an epic blind gamer, and you have to blind yourself. You know, so yeah, if you're not blind, then you can't be an epic gamer. So, it's time to get my epic blind gaming on. But Assassin's Creed. Uh, just before we jump right into it, I've got a very big history, big history, long history of Assassin's Creed, uh, the games uh, as a franchise. Um, I, I, I've pretty much played, I've played all of them, uh, apart from two, and that's Assassin's Creed 3 and Assassin's Creed The Road. I did, then they kind of rebooted the whole series of Origins, which I loved. Uh, if you know me, I am a huge, huge fan of ancient history. I feel really stupid wearing this stuff. I'm going to stop with the dumb little skit thing now. I'm still blind and epic, just... I don't, I don't need clothes to prove that anyway Origins was perfect i loved bayek i loved the whole story i loved the direction it took there was a few issues there here and there um but as an assassin's creed game it's up there with my favorites Pull assassin's creed and then obviously origins um then odyssey come out and this game is very polarizing with fans it's very you know there's there's a bunch of fans who say it's the best assassin's creed ever i don't believe that for a second uh, but i'll get into that later and then there's fans who say it's complete garbage it's shite, <laughs> it's terrible, it's a bad Assassin's Creed game, or it's just a bad game. And then there's the people in the middle who are like, it's a good game, but it's not a good Assassin's Creed game. And from what I've seen, from what I've heard, that's where I think I may fall. But I don't know, that's why I'm playing it today, that's why I'm doing this series. Um, it's, it's a nice, laid-back, easy series uh, about a blind video gamer. <laughs> uh, if you can't tell, I'm very close to the screen right now. It's a very big monitor. I'm not playing as an Assassin, because this is set, I think, 300 years before or maybe even longer i think it's 300 years i have to check before assassin's creed origins and assassin's creed origins is where the but you know the hidden ones is where the brotherhood was created so you're not an assassin in this and a lot of people's argument was why not just make an ancient greek rpg ubisoft why call it assassin's creed um and that's an interesting argument i i'm, I'm intrigued to get into it so lads lasses and everything in between let's jump right in and start our Odyssey. New game, my friends, my blinders, my blind people. I should say my non-blind people. I mean, there could be some blind people watching. So, holler at me. I can't read subtitles, so you know it's a luxury I don't have. I have to listen. Okay, it's a bit of lag there. <laughs> Not starting off strong. We are ready, my king. Sparta! Tell me, Venekis. Have you ever gone fishing with your son? No, never. A soldier's life is all I've had the honor to know. <laughs> I would have liked to have gone fishing with my son. Yo, is this the battle of Thermopylae? Famous, you know, there's the battle of 300, but that was a very, that's a very... Spartans! Nice, I'll, I'll be quiet. Every breath that you have taken... There was more than 300 Spartans. ...has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. 
Persians come Persians. to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. Fucking Persians. I say we drench the gods with their blood. What say you, Spartans? <laughs> For our sons! <laughs> For our daughters! For Sparta! Oh, fucking punks. Oh shit me, they're here, here we go! Am I playing? No. Oh shit, I think I'm playing now though. Let's jump right into this, laddies. Ladies, Did I just hear someone use a microaggression? <laughs> Blinders. Oh. Oh, but I'm not doing any of this. I think I'm about to take control in a second. This isn't me. It looks pretty. I wish I was just. I wish I was this good. Fuck me, yes. Oh shit! Get him, get him. Let me play. Let me own some fucking versions. Oh boy! Damn him! Ooh! Oh yeah, am I getting to play as a Spartan? Come on. Yeah, boy. Here we go, right. How do I play a game? There we go. Oh, this, this feels very different to Origins. I'm getting kind of used to the movements. Oh yeah. I lost my teammate. I'm stuck by me. It's a big dude! It's a big dude! How do I? Oh, okay. There we go. A blind warrior. Oh, I'm fire. What the fuck? I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Let's get stabbing him in the face. I ain't going to the wonder world, bitch. You are. I'm not super strong. Shit. Oh, it's good. All right, all right, all right, all right. I'm getting the hang of it now. Get deaded. Get deaded. Get deaded, boy. I could do jump attacks. Yeah. Oh shit, I just dodged that. Here we go. Oh, he goes straight. Oh shit. Is this. Is this. Yes, it's me. Punic Spartan! I'll bring Xerxes your head! You're gonna bring Xerxes my head. Ah. That's our dodge. So I figured it's all that in the last battle. You insolent Spartan fool! Come and get it! Keep dodging your thing. Keep dodging. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Ah. Oh, come on, fam. Today, oh, bloodline spy. Bloodline spy. Oh, what have I just done? Xerxes is the king of I'm kings. figuring shit out just by pressing buttons. Him I'm all gold and glowing. Come soon. Give us talk. Time to die. My son uh. is more of a warrior than you. Yeah. Once I'm done with you, king, all of Sparta's oh, I'm the king. Will be slaves. Oh, I'm Leonidas. Am I Leonidas? Oh. Would rather die. Get up, get up. <laughs> can I, can I do the, can I do the big attack? Yeah, I can. Yeah. yeah, man, I'm pretty tough. Just shouting shit there, mate. Oh, get Ray. No match for a Spartan. Nah, no match for a Spartan, mate. Not at all. Oh, we won. Look at that. For now. We are betrayed, my king. Xerxes knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> By dawn, he will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing. Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of Oh, mate! Get fucked. Hey! 
was a day the Persians will never forget. <laughs> Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. It's true. We do remember, mate. A lot of people remember inaccurately, but we remember. That's most of the Hollywood. Oh, shh. We're kicking straight off the modern day. Oh, no. What was that? She picked something up. Oh, here we go. Wow, this is big, Layla. Did you really Layla. think it's the spear? This is the one. The book was almost right on top of it. So is she an assassin now? I've never been so lucky in my life. Okay, let's start her up. Are you sure we can trust this thing? I mean, the book could be... Just out of Victoria. You're the boss, boss. I'll prep it for you. Where's uh, Desmond's dad? Well... His dad, they changed the actor, but you know. Oh. Okay, so Straight worth noting, I've made some changes since you were last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. One step at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. Well, this bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. Um, guided mode, exploration mode. So we're gonna go. We're gonna have fun with the game. Exploration mode. Um, let's go for it. I don't want. You don't need to yeah. worry about me. Just have to I've explore. got this. Like a little autonomy never killed anyone. At least, I don't think so. Just let me know if you need assistance, and I can always add the helpers back in. Listen, Layla, before you go off, if this book is right, this fear, this story, it will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Herodotus was the first recorded Homer? historian, so there's a lot Homer more Simpson? truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not going to let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're going to have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. Oh, this is where we get to pick between the man and the woman. Right. So we can be Alexios or Cassandra. Um, now, we're going to be the sexy lady. This is why I'm single. No, um, in the canon lore of Assassin's Creed, Cassandra is the main character. So when it comes to the books, because Ubisoft always do a book for some reason. And when it comes to the actual canon story, because they want you to have your own story. You can make your own story and blah, 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 all this cool stuff. But the Ganon story is Cassandra. I don't know why they just didn't make Cassandra the main character. You can do an RPG with just, you know, with a set character. You don't have to choose. Because Alexius doesn't exist, theoretically. He's a simulation. I don't know. So we're going to be Cassandra. Uh, we're going to be the lady. She'll help us find what we're looking for. I have a good feeling about this. All right, boss. We're finally good to go. 431 BCE, here we come. The start of the Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything, but we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't going to win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You Ooh. can do it. Oh, and Victoria, read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain. Oh, dear. See so here we are, assassins. Oh, here we are. Look. Boom. Straight into the animus. Alrighty. It's a bright light. We're dead already. <laughs> this is what I see every day. Okay. I was going to try and read that, but... <laughs> I think you said cat, Kepatatos or something. Got to leave the eagle. 
so far. Like, we're only like tw 10 minutes in, but I like the um, Battle of Phenomenal Fly out there. It's a pretty looking game. It's very pretty. Very nice to look at. So this is replacing Senu from Origins. I imagine this is our eagle. I also hear she's a better voice actor as well. Apparently Alexius isn't a very good voice actor. Hey! Shit face! Get okay. down here! So my nickname is Shit's Face? Cyclops Ooh. got a message for you! Cyclops? Did he just say? Tell your boss he can stick it. Oh! Shit! We're gonna have to fuck this guy up. He doesn't respect Wyman. Oh, here we go. The Cyclops said you like to act tough. The so act tough! Get a little closer, and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. If the Cyclops wants to teach me, tell him to come here himself. Ah! Never mess with the Cyclops! Ah, oh, okay, that's how you block. You press both. Blocking is both. Oh, but, but that, but come on. Oh, I'll get used to blocking. Come on. Come here again. Come here again. There we go. Now you fucking die. Okay, or not. Oh, he's down. He's on the floor. Is he dead? Uh, I'll kill him quick. Big mouth died easy. Die, fucking bitch. There we go. That's what you get for not respecting Wyman. Last week, this shit happens every week. Who's she talking to? I can't keep doing this. Who's talking to herself? Who is the Cyclops? Nah, Who? thanks for the warning. Oh. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Yes, yeah, fine. Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. I imagine it won't be like an actual Cyclops. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? Icarus. <laughs> Do you think Zeus would bless me with an ego like he blessed you, Cassandra? Maybe you could ask him for me. <laughs> oh shit! Yeah, I forgot. We have um, we have dialogue options. Should we lie? I'll just be like, nah, bitch. I ain't talking to Zeus. I think we'll be like, yeah, we'll talk to Zeus. She's only a little girl. We'll, we'll tell her that we'll, uh, we'll talk to Zeus. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. What does that weasel want now? No. Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. What? A vineyard? Malaka. It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him rich. I mean, I don't, I'm not really bothered. How long has he had it? I think whereabouts is pretty more important. Oh, Where can I find Marcus's new beautiful estate? You know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? It's south of that. South. Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. He's had it a day. So, <laughs> Marcos who owes me, Drachmi, is buying vineyards. 
With what money? Oh, he owes us money. I he don't owes know. us money. We gotta go collect. We gotta go get collecting. Well, I guess I owe Marcos a little visit. Yeah, we do. Thank you, Phoebe. Ha ha ha! Wait, I should have just been like, no, nah, I ain't talking to Zeus. I was talking to Zeus! I'll you. go tell Marcos you got me. Can I follow you? Oh. I thought I killed them. They're not dead. What? The choices you make will have an impact. You know what I'm okay, so it's like, yeah, so it's like a Mass Effect uh, <clears throat> or a Dragon Age. Uh, where the choices you make affect the outcome of the game. I wonder how heavily though, because it's possible it could be quite heavy. Hevel? Just to consider your options carefully. So I guess it could start conflicts and stuff from, from what I've heard. Interesting. It's different. Oh, you're dead or get out of here. Hmm. So I think killing them would... I'm just trying to think. How serious can... Here's the thing, right? This guy obviously wants to be dead. This Cyclops dude. Kill... If I kill these guys, he's just going to send more. If I send them back, he's just going to send more. I don't see how it can change. Maybe if I send them back, he'll be more lenient. Or maybe these guys will back me in a fight. Or We're going to be merciful. We're going to be a merciful Greek hero for now. We'll see. see, see what happens. Get out Hands of over. here. Tell that one-eyed freak if he ever sends you here again, I'm gonna cut out his other eye and feed it to my bed. Shit, yeah, she has one eye. We'll cut I'll eyes. see Marcos as soon as I'm dressed. Oh, we'll go get dressed. Okay, so, oh shit, we're in the game. I'll have to go up top to get dressed. Here we are, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So yeah, I, I'm guessing this, this Cyclops guy is... He's had one of his eyes cut out, so he just has one eye. So they call him Cyclops. And then obviously, like... That's interesting. I'm guessing the take on it is going to be, like, the myths. They're going to do the myths. Here we go. Free running. Oh. I've missed Assassin's Creed. I ain't going to lie. Well, the, the gameplay. Um, this is where I get dressed, yeah? Let's get this on. Let's get what on? Okay. Outfit. This is this pretty much very similar to Origins. Oh, slightly different. You actually have clothes. Ah, oh, that's cool. I could have a helmet. What do I actually have? I have a skirt. We have a tunic, I guess. Uh, actually, no, it does. It's just it's armor. It's armor then. Okay, cool. Uh, so our booties, gloves, and helmet. But yeah, you don't have a helmet. That's cool. That you can get helmets and stuff. Can you get a hood? I want a hood. <laughs> I already want a hood. Uh, I wonder how long it would take until I can get actual hood. Um, uh, the hidden blade. I guess the hidden blade isn't in this, is it? Of course it isn't. It's set before the hidden blade. Um, he's on the southern part of Mount Omnis. See that? See? Cool. Oh, see, we've turned off. We're on explanation mode, so I guess it won't show me. Like if I didn't have that on, if I go to the map, here we go. Check out the map. Ooh, I like. I, I really like the uh, Etsy family mix of them. Um... Okay, so we we can locate. Oh my god, this is fucking massive! It's like all of ancient Greece. Ah, so cool. Um, where are we? So we're on Kefalonia. Um, that's the name I couldn't catch for the beginning. Oh, it does give you markers. I thought it wouldn't. Basically, exploration mode is go look in this area, probably, instead of telling me what it actually is. So south, we're gonna we'll check over there. We'll explore. Do you know what? We're just gonna explore. Fuck it. Yeah, we're just gonna explore. I mean, we're in exploration mode. So this is our house. This is our gaff. Hey, this is our crib. This is where we be chilling. It's fine. It's not bad. Oh, what's this? Marcos knew this would serve young Cassandra well. Can't imagine fighting the Cyclops' thugs with it now. Ah, uh, did Marcos raise us? There we go, say that. I'm guessing that we're adopted or our parents died or something. 
I'm just only just thinking. I'm. It's, I guess there must be some sort of relevance to the Battle of Thermopylae. Like, that's obviously a big part of the story, or we're related to Leonidas, maybe. Oh, that'd be cool. We could, yeah, we could be related to. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's go. Let's explore. Can I get a house? Um, we must be related to Leonidas in some way. Oh, I love, I fucking love the movement, man. Oh shit! Get some tree pod core going. Oh, 